This video is about how to fix high ping and boost FPS using no ping. There are many reasons your game might lag. Things like bad network routing, background services, or incorrect system settings. No ping helps fix routing issues and applies one-click Windows optimizations that reduce latency and free up CPU and RAM for gaming. Before using it, my FPS was lower and my ping was very unstable. But after applying these optimizations, I got a noticeable FPS boost and a much more stable, lower ping. This video is sponsored by No Ping, but that doesn't change my honest opinion of the tool. So make sure to subscribe and drop a like on this video to support the channel. All right, before we get started, if you want to download this tool, you can grab it from the link in the video description. Using that link, you can try out the free trial and even get an extra discount. When you open No Ping, you'll see three main areas. Top left, connection slash game selection, center, server graph and routing, bottom system, stats, CPU, GPU, and an optimize slash boost button. Think of No Ping as two tools in one. It finds the best network route to the game servers, and it has a built-in Windows and game optimizer to reduce background load and latency, and it is much better and cheaper than other optimizers in the market. Click search and type your game. For example, Fortnite. Select it. No ping will show you a list of servers in a small root graph. Use the recommended tab first. That's no ping's AI picking the server with best root for your ISP. If you want to test manually, pick the closest server or the one with the lowest ping shown. Click Optimize Game or Connect. What this does, no ping opens a private route between you and the game servers. Fewer hops, less packet loss, so your ping becomes lower and more stable. Note that always connect your server with Noping before launching the game. Next, we have multi-internet tab. If you have multiple connections, for example, Wi-Fi plus mobile hotspot or a second WAN, Noping's multi-internet can use both to improve root availability and reduce packet loss. This is advanced, only enable it if you actually have two live connections. Now for the next step, open the Boost FPS slash Settings panel in Noping and enable the options you need. I'll explain the important ones you'll see in the app. Disable Windows Compatibility Assistant. Stops background Windows checks and crash report uploads that can interrupt CPU cycles during gaming. Disable Chrome slash Edge Telemetry. Stops browser telemetry tasks from running in the background and using CPU or network. Enable Home Gaming Mode slash Optimize Cores. Forces Windows to prioritize foreground slash game processes and reduces core parking so more cores are active for the game. Disable Dynamic Ticks. Forces more stable timing behavior in Windows, which can reduce micro stutters. Optimize Windows Explorer slash Compact Mode. Reduces Explorer overhead and animations so Alt plus Tab is snappier. Flip the toggles you want, then click Apply or Optimize. Noping will either apply registry changes or toggle system settings for you. Most are reversible in the same UI and also if you want the most stable settings for Windows, so you can use the standard option from the top bar of the Noping. It will automatically optimize the best settings for your Windows. Okay, so next we got here Pro Settings. Noping includes Pro Settings and Preset Configs used by Pro Players. You can import a pro profile for your game. This applies a tested bundle of network plus system tweaks. Next, go for Green Aim tab. It is an optional aiming trainer slash visual tweak tool, useful if you want training plus low latency setup, but it's not required for routing. Use the provided pro profile for Fortnite if you want a one-click optimized setup. After applying all these optimizations using no ping, my FPS literally doubled. Before this, I was running on default Windows settings, but after enabling these tweaks, the difference was clear. My ping didn't drop drastically at about 4 to 5 milliseconds lower, but it became way more stable. Before, my shots in Fortnite sometimes wouldn't register, but now the game feels super responsive and smooth. That's it. No ping fixes the network route and gives you a convenient set of Windows optimizations to reduce background load and latency. Record your before after numbers, drop them in the comments. If this helped, hit like, subscribe, and I'll make a follow up showing advanced no ping profiling and how to combine it with GPU slash CPU optimizations for even more gains. See you in the next one.